Y'all seen that title, y'all already know what time it is. We about to be going out the country once again. So, and y'all, we able to experience business class for the first time. Yeah, so the first flight is 13 hours long. And we open. <laughs> we flying backwards. We flying backwards. I didn't drop that whole little glass of champagne. My head's spinning, that's why I don't drink. <gasps> Oh, y'all, we finally made it to Doha. So we got like a nine hour layover. We're on our second plane. We don't have a suite on this one. It's just regular business class. Y'all, yeah. we just landed in the middle of the ocean. We're on our way to see where we at. One, two, three, get where we at. Y'all seen that title, y'all already know what time it is. We about to be going out the country once again. So make sure y'all comment down below where y'all think we going. But y'all seen that title, we about to be flying business class. Oh my God, y'all, we finally made it to business class. Oh my God, I just don't know how to feel like what? Y'all know we always talk about how we want to fly in business class, but baby, the Lord is good, God is good, y'all is good, y'all have been so good to us, and y'all, we able to experience business class for the first time. Like, come on now. Y'all know we want to fly business class in Bora Bora, but I guess God said I got bigger and better things, so y'all so, y'all, we got a whole bed on this junk. We got a whole double bed, we got a suite, we can close the door, and I'm just super excited. So y'all, we got a 30 hour flight in total so we gotta take two planes no we gotta take three, three planes and a boat once again we quite in a rush right now because we gotta be at the airport about seven and it's currently six o'clock so we need to hurry up i'm super excited for this trip this has been one of dream vacation destination is so like it's so good to be able to accomplish these things like back to back. As y'all know, we just came from Bora Bora. Now we headed to here. So I cannot wait. We actually don't arrive until tomorrow. So like I said, this is a 30 hour flight and this vlog is about to be super, 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 super long because y'all already know we gotta, we gotta get out of full, like the full experience us going to the airport, get on this plane with the beds. Then we got a hotel room. Breathe. I'm excited, I'm excited. Let me let y'all holler at Kim because I gotta make sure I got stuff together. I need to go find his neck pillow because baby, I do not need my man neck to be hurt. I'll just buy another one. So, she basically told y'all everything. We've been up since 9 a.m., really 8.30. Been up since like 8.30 a.m. Trying to make sure we got everything in order. I had to get a haircut. Oh. I'm chug, you know what I'm saying? I'm chug, you already know who got me right? You know what I'm saying? Got the bitches naked, windbreaker, ooh. So, we woke up today and we was like, dang, it's kind of cold outside. Did not expect it to be cold outside. Now it's cold outside, but guess what? We finna change up the what, Queen Renee? We finna change up the what? The weather. What you put in my back? I'm gonna put your neck pillow right here. Oh, you found it? Yeah. Thank you. Gotta make sure my man's good. Cause you know your neck already kinda messed up, so I don't know how to do it, but there you go. Okay, hopefully it don't fall off. So we have to book our Uber. Quita, you gonna book the Uber or do I need to um, book? Um, you can book it because I need to get some TikTok footage. Okay, so. Oh, we didn't pick up our toothpaste, so you already got one. I threw one in, I threw one somewhere. If not, it's not gonna be like, well, you know, the other time where we didn't have, we couldn't find no toothbrush like the cruise. So let me book out Uber. I'm excited. I've been trying to keep my composure because I don't want to be too, you know what I'm saying, amped up. I am amped up. It's my birthday because coming Because it's your up. birthday yeah. trip. It's your birthday trip. I gotta accept guidelines on Uber. I ain't got time for this. Okay. Oh. Quit, are you sure you, you sure you want me to do this? Okay. I don't want to take the um, fam because they once we landed in Bora Bora, they were hiding the money. So I just confirmed our Uber ride. We well we didn't we didn't overpack per se. I mean I mean I, I can't say that. I mean we always overpacking. Our Uber is going to be arriving in possibly like six minutes. We're just gonna get some TikTok. I need to be getting some TikTok, but I can't because I need to make sure everything is in order, okay? So our Uber is currently seven minutes away. Y'all, this is why we were running a little bit late. We was in the nail shop today for like three hours. I guess they just stopped working on Quita Nails and I don't know. You got the passports? I have the passports indeed. But let me put y'all down until we um, get in the Uber or something so I can make sure everything's all right. But y'all, this is gonna be the best trip. This out of our whole journey of trips this is the best trip so the uber is one mile away one mile away and ken is getting everything downstairs y'all once we come back home we got a big surprise for y'all and we cannot wait to share it with y'all 
sick of these stairs. <laughs> so we got a big surprise once we come home and we cannot wait to share it with y'all. So he getting everything together. I got my stuff right here. I got my carry-on and my new suitcase. I went ahead and bought a new suitcase from Target so my stuff can be matchy matchy. So yeah, I'm gonna be wheeling through the airport like oops. Just finished checking in. We're about to get ready to head to TSA. We're gonna go through the gate. This is a platinum colored boarding pad. Yeah, I'm super excited to be in business class. Like, what? We ain't had to wait in no line. Come on now. So, we're gonna get ahead to our gate. And then we probably just gonna relax. I don't know if we can go to the lounge or not. We should try to go to the lounge, but I don't really don't care for the lounge. You wanna go care. to the lounge? I don't really care for it either. Yeah. So, let us go to TSA. Then we'll update y'all. A few moments later. Man, we just got out of TSA. Oh, this our gate right here? Look at us. We ain't gotta go too far. This is our second time being in here. Last time we was in here, we was going to Bora Bora. But TSA is like a, going through TSA. Going through TSA is a workout, bro. You gotta take everything out. They don't be aggressive with us for real, for real, though. Why you come all the way in this cut? We gonna board first. We ain't gotta sit all the way over here by the home. But, yeah, like I was saying, going through TSA is most definitely a workout. You be sweating, you be tired. You gotta put everything back up. I'm glad this terminal, or well, this side of the airport isn't like the other side, like domestic, but you gotta yeah. catch a train and all this other stuff, all this walking. Let Whew. me tell y'all this. This time we ain't giving y'all no clues. Y'all seen our boarding pass when we was on the way to Fort Fort. We ain't showing y'all nothing. Is it? If we, like, we gotta sit down and watch our footage. So if we do slip up, it might be a blur or cut, uh, cut or something. We in the moment right now, we rushing, kind of. But now that we calm down, no more, no more secrets. No more, no more hints, no more nothing. Y'all just gotta stay tuned. Clear this, ooh, she over there getting her cards, man. Eh? over there showing off her business class ticket. But let me catch my breath and make sure that we don't need to go to any one of these stores and grab anything that we need. We probably finna go find us something, like some snacks or something. Y'all know we love snacks. Business class shout We finally made it. It's been a long ride, but we here, okay? Started off in premium class. And now we in business class. Period. You, you doing all this. It's my birthday. I'm the one that need to be talking like her. I ain't gonna do all that period and whatnot. I ain't that ain't that ain't me. That ain't it's not what I do. Y'all gonna see me pop my job when uh when we get to where we going. Well really when we get on this plane. Cause listen here, we the first in our bloodline to do this. We starting something new with the fam. Imagine we be so successful one day. We just put our whole family on a, on a, on business and we just go on a big family business trip. I'm speaking way ahead in the future. Hold on, y'all. Let me calm down. Kenny uh, just reminded us that we need to get snacks because y'all, did we even tell y'all how long the first flight is? So the first flight is 13 hours long, literally. Kenny, how long the first hour flight? 13 hours. And then we have a nine hour layover, and then we have another five hour flight along with like a one hour flight and then a boat ride to the resort. So I'm gonna go ahead and get what I want because this is the last time we put have some American stuff. So I think I want me some pineapple Fanta. I'm not getting no chips because remember last time we was in the air and no chips was in the mm. bus. They ain't got no basket. Go see do they got like a little basket. You don't basket. need no basket, you have a man. Oh. And thank you for my man. What are you getting? I ain't really getting nothing too crazy. I had got, I got some snacks this in my back. Everything on the plane is unlimited, can I? Who don't get something to drink for? Just the hell. Oh, well I'm good. We get you a little snack. And little snack, snack. We good. So I just got a text message saying we're about to get ready and board in a minute. Y'all, we got business class, so that means we should be boarding first. I'm super excited. I know they said once we get on this plane, they're about to greet us with like drinks and stuff. I'm super excited. I just feel like we is beyond blessed to be able to be in business class. I can't believe it. This been on my vision board since last year. And I put it on my vision board this year. And I finally can check this on my vision board. Oh my goodness, y'all, we finna get y'all the full experience. I cannot. Attention Qatar Airways passengers, my name is Aisha Two, and on behalf of Qatar Airways, I would like to welcome you all on QR756 today. Your flight will be roughly 13 hours and 20 minutes. If you could please take a look at your boarding passes underneath your seat number or your respective zones. Zones 1 and 3 is underneath the F9 sign, and zones 2 and 4 is underneath the concourse sign. Towards the middle area of the gate again, we welcome our business class priority members to line up. We will begin boarding today with all wheelchair passengers. You ready?
don't know how to feel. I don't know what to say right now. We made it, y'all. We here, like, mm. y'all. We gotta get our full tour of this real quick. We gonna do it fast before we take off. All right, y'all. We gonna have to show y'all how the queen walk into her business class suite. Okay, so this whole thing come down, and this seat actually turns into a bed. Okay, like look at the big screen. Yeah. yeah, we got it. So, we can't close it up. I guess it's locked right now. So, can't close it up. And we got a gift. We got some dipty. I think it's some other stuff, like some hand cream and stuff in here. So, I'm super excited to try this. Oh, we got blanket and cover. I'm gonna let y'all see Kenny Marby sign. that boy in me. What you working with over there, get Y'all yeah, know I'm seven feet tall, so they got my, they got me right. I'm finally stretching out. You, know you can stretch I mean? all the way out. I can stretch Ooh, all the way out. That boy's stretched oh, out. Get, um, you know I'm seven feet tall, so shoot, they got me right. Got my my back pillow, because Quita said my back be messed up. We got a desk. We got, that ain't no desk. That's a desk. That's a desk. Mm. We got the radio. We got the features. We're going to show y'all the features when... You know, things kind of calm down. We don't want to just give y'all all everything all at once because we is on this plane for 13 hours. 13 hours. So as y'all know, my taste buds and my sense of smell have been gone for the past week. But they brought us some champagne. Y'all know I don't drink, but I'm trying to do anything to get my sense of taste back, sense of smell. And I think that right there did it for me. Look at it. Even they show me your champagne. Do it for what you think? I don't know, y'all. Mm. You got a bed and your legs can't even reach. You <laughs> just sit back in the leg. Man, little long leg. So I'm gonna open my gift up. It's called the Deep Tea. They got it wrapped up so nice. Let's see what we get. Oh, look at that. 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 So we got some fresh lotion. It smells so good. Some lip balm, some face cream, and some spray. It smells so good. Come on, what I got in mind. The same thing. Y'all, we actually flying backwards, I think. I know y'all probably like, how y'all flying backwards? I really think we finna fly backwards. What you think, Kenny? I told her we flying backwards. She don't listen. We finna take off in the turbulence. It's gonna be mm -hmm. way different than expected. Let me get some of that. I think my sense of smell is coming back. So it's almost like they knew I was a man sitting in this seat. Okay, let's see what we got. We got it too. Uh-oh. Oh, oh, no, oh no, that's gone. Love. That's gone. It's just oh, a piece of paper. Same thing. Same thing. They just case you up different. Case me up. This the same thing. Smell good. Ooh, I ain't, I'm gonna save mine. I like saving. You can my use stuff. mine. I still got the stuff from Bora Bora. We just put in our dinner order. Dinner will be out 20 minutes after takeoff. So I'm super excited. I ordered some beef, some brownie, and some Sprite. So I cannot wait to taste everything. I really think it's going to be really, really good. What you get? You're going to be drunk. It's my birthday. Okay, Mr. Birthday Boy. My head spinning is why I don't drink. I'm chilling. I'm not chilling. It's an undrunk day. This is why I don't drink. Fucking scared. But we got a whole bunch of movies that we can watch. This this comes with a lot. We got. It. Let me just show y'all. They got a funny. Oh my goodness. I'm finna watch Night at Freddy's. We got Avengers. We got the Infinity War Avengers. Uh, what else they got on here? Uh, man, Bullet Train. That was a good movie. This is gonna be the most exciting 13 hour, 14 hour flight I have ever experienced. Now, I ain't gonna lie though, get that food again. I'm doing this again. I don't know where we gonna go, but we gonna do this again. You gonna, oh, she, she with me. That's dangerous. A few moments later. We're taking off. Bro, how they know my size in my pajamas? How oh, we are medium. Quit her. They got your right size. That's small. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe they look on our passport information. <laughs> Man, my passport don't say I'm a medium person. Shoot. Uh oh, we're taking off. We're turning and we're going backwards. I gotta see y'all in a second. I'm gonna be sick.
bent backwards. What in the world? How you feeling? Oh my God. This is our first time flying out. Oh my God. You know what I'm back? You need to turn around. too much pressure in my neck. You need to. He should never drunk that drink. I don't think I like this. See, you the other way. I can't see. <laughs> you need to tell me this way. Okay. He's being dramatic. later all right y'all so we finished with dinner they about to come and make our bed in a few seconds we didn't actually was gonna put on the pajamas that they gave us me oh um, i like put them on i'm gonna put them on this is once a lifetime experience so i'm about to put my pjs on and then king will put his pjs on the bathroom it's super nice like Put his PJs on and we're gonna do it. We believe that I brought Uno, but I don't know if we're gonna play Uno. We might play Uno. We're gonna see. Man, we're gonna do a big old shift. We're not afraid of this one. 
A few moments later. They just made our bed up, like made my bed back, and I'm gonna crash up. So you can't fit. Put it laying all the way back. I can just go ahead. This is the only way he want to fly. I'm not flying nothing else. I either got to work hard or, or, don't, this, fly or don't fly at all. <laughs> Y'all, this so fancy. I'm just trying to wrap this around my head. I just got I just got on some plain pajamas in my plain bed. 30 inch TV. I could eat anything I want. I got a cooler slab deep freezer right here. Let me show you. My deep freezer under here. I'm sitting there watching Gaza. Somebody snoring. Well, I'm gonna be snoring too soon. I'm gonna go and get caught. I'm gonna finna let me. Finishing up his movie. I took a Benadryl, so I'm finna go to sleep. And we will see y'all in the morning. Y'all know once this bunny come on, it's bedtime. We got our beers together, and then we got our PJs on, and we finna go to bed. She just stole my butterfingers. I got me a whole pack of butterfingers. And she done took my butterfingers. Uh-huh, see that's what you do. You ate them butterfingers and now we got that turbulence. And now, you over there sick. Mm-hmm. You on that bed. And now you got that turbulence. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, no. yeah, no. yeah, yeah, yeah. But I don't see myself going to bed no time soon with the plane like this. So, we'll see y'all in a second. Whenever this turbulence stop, if you get bad, I'm just gonna pull the camera back out and I'm gonna document the roughness. I ain't gonna say that too crazy, I'm gonna say the roughness. Damn. Let me sit up. We got 10 hours. We can't get off this. Oh my goodness, I'm not getting the book here. Sit up. I'm supposed to go to sleep. Oh. I'm finna go get me up. I'm finna sit, I'm finna sit my bed up. Goodness gracious. It is 1 a.m. And my map has not updated. It is the 
next day. Hey, baby. Let's talk about this turbulence in my ears. Turbulence was turbulent, but we gonna get it today. So we got about two hours, 34 minutes left. I can't hear. My ears, it's hurting so bad, I can't even hear. You can hear? But we're gonna get up and put our clothes on because we are gonna be landing shortly, so we need to go ahead and start getting up. I might go in there and brush my teeth. Oh, you gonna brush your teeth? Oh, okay, Kenny wanna brush his teeth at the hotel. Yeah, I can't hear. Okay, they go right here. So I'm gonna go put my clothes on, and I guess we're gonna just get up. ordered breakfast. We was going to plan on getting breakfast, but we didn't really get breakfast. Well, now we got breakfast. Could have got some orange juice. Ooh, you need it. Yeah. So I just got cereal, water, and orange juice. Then I got waffles. So me and Kim, we're going to show the waffle. Hey, y'all, we was on this plane like that. We're going to tell y'all about that in a little bit, but we're going to go ahead and eat. So Kenny got his breakfast. What did it taste like? Oh, look. We got the full fat milk. Oh, no. You ready? Oh, no, no, no. You gotta hit the same time. Three. Three, two, one. Who's going past me? You trying to put it up in the sink. We finally made it to Doha. Make sure y'all comment down below what y'all think we going. We still got two flights in a boat. And y'all, we literally been traveling since yesterday and we don't get there till tomorrow. So it's been a full two days of traveling. Then we got like an eight hour layover. Yeah, so we got like a nine hour layover. So we in our hotel room. Um, y'all know when we went to World War, we did not get a hotel room. But this time, Queen Renee was not playing getting us a hotel room. And it's y'all, this hotel is really, really nice. Really so nice. We gonna go ahead and give y'all a tour. I'm so glad we got a hotel room because we can freshen up. Then we can go back downstairs, get food, come back to our room and just relax. So. Also, on the flight in, I was looking out the window. We in the middle of the desert. So it's light. Eh, I'll say Doha is like Dubai. A lot of people was coming on that Instagram like, y'all in Dubai, y'all going to Dubai. No, no not we ain't going to Dubai. Yeah, told we could have went. Yeah, I told Ken, I said, why are we here? We might well go, go to Dubai. It's just an hour flight. But he was like, nah, we're going to wait. We're going to save it for another time. So we're going to go ahead and do this tour. And y'all. It's a really nice hotel, so if y'all come to Doha, make sure y'all come stay at the Oryx Airport Hotel. Well, once you had your layover here, I mean, I think it's, it was two other hotels, wasn't it? I'm not sure. I, I think, think it was. It's the only one. It was some on the sign, but this one? Yes. Yeah. Nice. 
Nice. We could have went to the lounges, but I feel like this better than the lounge. We can go down there and get our own food if we want to. We can go back to our room, get in the dark, and just go to sleep. So, you ready? Let's hop into this room tour. All right, so as y'all can see, we by the front door. This door is huge, like it's really, really big. But when we come over here, well, we come on over here to the bathroom. This is a really big bathroom. Hey, ain't this a toilet you want to use? Do it shoot the water. It, that's not no toilet. Kenny want water shot in his dick. No, I do not. I don't know why. I just <laughs> want to see it shoot. I want to push the button and watch oh. it shoot. I don't want to oh. shoot the water in my own. Oh, but Kenny got his own toilet. I got my own toilet. That's not no toilet. This is a toilet. That's why you stand up and go like that. So you we got to We call and ask somebody, is this a toilet? Because if I pee in this, and that's a sink. That, it's a sink right here. <coughs> so. Toilet for Kenny, toilet for Queer Renee. So we're gonna use the bathroom at the same time? And we got this big, huge Queer Renee. We headed to well. Well, we headed to coming down below. Okay, so let's go ahead. Oh, they got a, a telephone in case you get stuck and need help, like Kevin Hart on Soul Plane. <laughs> so, once you come over here, we got a double sink. I love these sinks, it's so freaking nice. Kenny sink, my sink. And then we have a big walk in shower with a big rainfall. Mm -hmm. Then, while you're in the shower, you can be looking over there in the mirror, like, oh, look too good. Oh. Yeah. Oh, no, show too much. No show okay. too much. So we got some shower gel, some conditioners, and some shampoo, which we're not gonna use because we got our own stuff. Exit in out this lovely luxurious bathroom. Come on, quick Renee. Oh, that's a hair dryer? That's a hair dryer? I'm not sure. I thought it was a vacuum at first. What you gonna vacuum? I don't know. You gonna vacuum your your <laughs> Shut up. I wanted to say this was a closet so bad, but it it's is. not. It is? Oh. Oh, that's just that's just abstract decoration. That's just decor. All right, let's keep it pushing. We got a hallway, thermostat, light switch. Give oh, that was lamp. Oh, whole time we walked in, he was like, "How did the lights turn on?" <laughs> so they did say we have a coffee and a tea bar. It's very it's complimentary, so we can drink as much as we want and won't get charged. Then we got some cabinet space. Oh, wow! Well, I like that. You got lights. Nice. Who's nice? Oh, we got some slides. Quick. Look. We only here for a few hours. We don't need much for a few hours. And another closet which has robes. <laughs> And then you walk this way, you got us a nice size TV. This is a luxury trip. I'm not even gonna lie, the plane mm -hmm. set it off for me. Then we got this, what this is, a queen? King. Or king? King. King size. And then, you know, if we would have brought our child with us, who was old enough, they probably would have had their own bed. But you know, kids nowadays sleep with their mommy and their dad. Nightstand, two little lamps. And then we got a view overlooking, I want to say a mall, but it's really the airport. And we also gonna go down there and we gonna show y'all everything. Y'all know we gotta find some food. They you know, I screenshot it. Gordon Ramsay Burgers, the Gordon Ramsay Pizza, the Fendi Shop, and the Oreo Shop. So we gotta eat four places. Mm -hmm. They said it's Ramadan. The restaurant's open? I guess you can't eat in public. She said in public. So we probably can come back to the room and eat. Oh. Okay, that's cool. And then we got a little office table that we're gonna use to chop this video up a little bit. That way we can get these videos pushed out for y'all. ASAP. And lately on our trips, they've been doing the little QR codes on these mm -hmm. little wooden little blocks. I think that's so nice. Yeah. So that is the full room, as y'all see. Y'all, we about to lay it down, probably. Kenny's why he want to shower, lay down, then go downstairs. But I am in like, I want to go eat, shower, then lay down. That's how I'm feeling. How you feeling? I'm on vacation. We can do it out. All right. We just walked <laughs> around for like 30, 45 minutes trying to figure out what we was going to eat. Looking for Gordon Ramsay restaurant we couldn't find. So we found this place called Draft Burger. If y'all do come here, you can just follow our steps. We're going to do all the hard work and looking for y'all. Found Draft Burger. Didn't find the Fendi Cafe. We just said it's put just upstairs. So yeah. yeah. I don't know if they have daylight savings time or what, but it is nighttime. It's 5 o'clock and it's already Look at this. Somebody explain to me. We can big old so y'all know we we got the usual cheeseburger. Take before all the extra stuff off, island. huh? Before we get on this island. Oh yeah, before we get on this island, I'm not gonna 
sit up here and tell y'all I'm finna eat burgers the whole trip. I'm not gonna do that to myself. I'm gonna try and be new. I already can't taste nothing for real, for real. But that's a good thing. Quit is in the same boat, so therefore, she can have- taste coming back. It's coming back slowly. Slowly, but that means you can try more foods. You can try more items. Yeah. This airport is so big. I thought we was finna get lost. It like, we seen so many stores. I tried to find, let me tell y'all this. I left all my sunglasses. If y'all remember last time in Bora Bora, my eyes was red. That's because I was staring into the sun for like 20 seconds, bro. I was trying to fly the drone and my eyes t ended up turning red for like, how long was it? Three days? Yeah. I have no sunglasses and they don't have any sunglasses that I would like in here. So I'm out of luck. I packed everything but my sunglasses. So, I told Kenny go up there and give me some more mayo. He said the lady was being rude to him. We, we gonna tell y'all once we get back to the hotel room. So these folks is rude out here. This is the first time we ever encountered like a rudeness. Like, get it together. Bro, that lady told me, I said, may I please get some more ketchup and mayo? She said, it's there already. I ain't say nothing. Yeah, let, me, let us show y'all this food so we can talk to y'all once we get back to our hotel room. We back in the room. We just finished eating the draft burger. We about to get ready and shower and get some Z's in. We got like five more hours. So the lady gonna call us at 11.30 when it's time for us to go board our plane. But well, when it's time for us to check out, so. She was nice. The reception lady yeah. at the, um, with the hotel, she was nice. But man, after that lady told me, I just wanted some, some mayo and some ketchup. And what she tell you? What she said? Don't you already have some? You already have some? I don't know. Y'all, they been so rude. I ain't gonna say they. I, I'm just gonna single out three people, including her. The one lady didn't want to help Quita. On the plane. I don't know, man. She didn't want to help me because I ain't know how to um take the remote out. I ain't know how to take the remote out the thing. Then my bed had broke. I forgot yeah. to tell y'all that. And they didn't want to help Ken with his bed. Then I was trying to get some B-rolls and the lady gonna tell me I didn't want to be recorded. I said I'm not recording you. You know what I'm saying? So we finna shower. Hopefully it's our next destination where we going. I doubt it because guess this what? This is a travel destination. We have looked up some reviews. The airline. Experience and they kind of felt the same way but a little bit harsh. Yeah. Her in Doha in particular, we don't know how the next location gonna be. I just think it was her. I mean, she looked like she didn't want to be there. She having a bad day at work. She probably, had, but she ain't had to take out on me. I asked her nicely. I, I was talking to her nicely. She when I was trying to, pick, I was trying to figure out what I'll come on the burger, and she was like, "It's a classic." Okay, I said, "Okay, get away. Let's just go ahead. Just go ahead. Let's go back to our room. Let's go shower, lay down, and Damn. get out of here." We can't. We is a look. We don't. We don't want to do nothing and end up in trouble. Yeah, because you know, certain countries like this have rules. It's basically like Dubai. And I'm just like, can I don't know what we can and can't do. And if they Ramadan, you can't eat in public. You can't do some other stuff in public. So we trying to be cautious. So once we get from out of here in Doha, we gonna let y'all know. Cause y'all know we'll bust that camera out like this. And just, yeah. But blogging away. So we just gonna get some cinematic shots of this airport because this is a airport. very beautiful airport. So yeah. we bought, what time should we bought at 1230? Yeah, so we bought at 1230. Our flight leave at 1 a.m. So I'm finna go ahead and get some rest. Y'all got dark so quick. This literally the quickest like day I done had ever in my entire life being there. It done got dark so fast. I barely seen daylight today. Another thing too, like when we was landing, all I seen was like pipes and it was like a different color water. I know y'all saw this video of this man when he got ate by that shark in Egypt. That's kind of what it looked like. It's kind of like sandy. Like you know how you go to uh, like you in Texas. Texas got that dry, you know, green grass look. It looked yeah. fake out there. I hear it looked like a sandstorm came like three days ago. Yeah, and it, it was, was cloudy. Dusty. It was just cloudy. Y'all kind of wish we could have seen like the city and stuff, but it's on a, cool. On a bright sunny day. Yeah. Maybe once we come back, we can sit by a window so we can see the city once we leave. So y'all can see that because they want us to bring them home with us. So they say, y'all just be in it. So we're like, we'll get y'all the full thing, but let us go shower so we can get us a little rest before we snap us to board out five hour flight yes we got another five hour what? flight yes okay on this flight do we get some kind of comfortability like how that's yeah up? we, we can get a bed down. i think so but it ain't no sweet we just in business class they but we right by each other look when we hopped off our plane we didn't see nobody else they had business class buses that took us to the airport yeah uh, huh? we're gonna get on another bus once it's time for us to work because they're gonna take us to the plane and we're gonna go get on our seat if it's so. choppy if it don't make sense how we travel we're doing the best we can we just do not know if we can record in public places. Yes. So let us go take our bath once it's time for us to boy at 12.30. We'll let y'all know. We just woken up from, I guess, a nap. Well, I had a nap. I went to sleep for like two hours. And it is currently 10 o'clock at night. 
We gotta go find us some toothpaste because I don't know what happened to our toothpaste that was in our carry-on. We were supposed to pick up a small little tube of toothpaste from, you know, the little shops that they be having that you can get stuff from. And we got everything but toothpaste. Dang, I need to brush my teeth because it's like a weird texture tasting. You know, that weird texture, to, like that morning taste that's in your mouth. Then I can't smell, so I don't even know if my breath hot. We finna go downstairs and we finna go search around and see if we can find some toothpaste. We're about to get ready to head out, y'all. This hotel room is freezing, so I told Ken, I said, let's go ahead, let's go check out. We probably go see that they got some food somewhere. I'm pretty sure they don't because it is like 11 o'clock, so they probably ain't got no food. But we're finna go back downstairs, check the monitor to make sure our screen where the gate is the correct gate that we need to go to because we don't have a gate on our boarding pass. So yeah, we got a five hour flight and then we got another one hour flight and then we got a boat to the resort. I have on slides, y'all. Y'all probably wonder like why I got on slides. Don't say it because we're gonna give away too many information. Yeah, so make sure y'all keep coming down below where y'all think we at. Some of y'all probably got it by, like got it by now. But I know once we get to the airport, we'll probably show y'all a little sneak peek. But make sure y'all keep coming down below. Quita messed me up when she said, ain't nothing gonna be open for us to get nothing to eat. So now I'm just like, dang. In my head, y'all know what I thought about? I thought about Whataburger breakfast. Y'all sleeping on Whataburger breakfast, can't lie. And Waffle House. We not in America. We tried to find a Burger King and we couldn't find it. So I I doubt. It was an upstairs area, so maybe we go upstairs and check something out, see what they got, you know what I'm saying? I know Quita really did want to go to the Fendi Cafe. So if we do see the Fendi Cafe, I'm just say go ahead. I gotta get some pictures of this airport because this airport, I ain't seen nothing like it. This in our house. Wait up. All them cold stains I got. She told me, why is it sad? All oh, mine said. Yo, we see the Oreo Cafe. This is the side to be in. It's a garden. So we can go get some of this street pizza. You want some street pizza? Please, can we eat it, Mr. Gordon Ramsay? You better come out. America, we gotta get it together because we ain't got nothing that look like this. Camera not even doing it justice. Ooh, they got some black soap. But anyway, show them over here. We at Gordon Ramsay's street pizza restaurant Ooh, in yeah. the burger shop right next to Yes. Why don't we just say walk now? It's cool. We we'll, we'll come back here. So we'll ask for We're gonna stay at the garden hotel. You want to? Please. This side of the hotel, well not the hotel, this side of the airport is beautiful. Like I was saying, America, y'all made me president. Shoot, I put one of these and you can't put this in Atlanta. You can't put this, this in. This is what Atlanta needs. This is what Atlanta need, but no. After what happened to Six Flags, no. This need to be in like LA. What if the Burger King over here? I ain't stunned on Burger King. We finally eating at Gordon Ramsay. I've been trying to tell Quill, Gordon Ramsay got the best food in Vegas, from my experience, but we just ordered a pepperoni pizza. Nothing too crazy. And Quill over here questioned whether it's gonna be good or not. And I'm telling her, it's gonna be good. But yeah, we on our business class bus, and then yeah, they finna drive us to our plane. You get your own bus when you get the business class. Mm -hmm. I can't, I, I can't go back. Y'all, no, it's a big double decker Qatar plane right in front. Of us.
We don't have a suite on this one. It's just regular business class. Right now, Kenny, he ordering his food and they greeted us with a welcome drink. I got an orange juice because I want the orange juice and this orange juice is really, really good. It's good. So yeah, I'm gonna order my food. Then I'm gonna show y'all the food once again. I like this plane. They so nice. They already smiling in my face. See, ain't nobody smiled in my face this whole time. Now, if I get to tell these folks in my birthday, they gonna come around here like Texas Roadhouse, start clapping and stomping and stuff on the plane. Turbulence gonna be on a whole nother level. But it's my second. Y'all know I don't drink, but they offer it and it's free, so I'm gonna drink. Then somebody called me childish one day. Remember that one time they called me childish because I don't drink? But they talking. Hold on. I'm sorry. Come on. Got a chicken sandwich with onions. I ain't never had no onions, but I'm gonna try. You ain't never had no onions. You ain't no human. I ain't even no one. You ain't from Earth. You need to get your own shit. This is like the last flight, but I do have a surprise. So if you made it this far throughout this video, I do have a surprise. I brought my birthday gift with me. So I'm really excited to show y'all that. Family ain't flying out. And we got some good movies. Well, I got some good movies. Once the omelet come out, you know, we'll show you everything. Oh, here you go. Use your remote. It's no joke. Did you open the door? Oh, hot towel. Hot towel, hot towel. Thank you. Cold towel. Cold. Thank you. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you. We get picked up in a Tesla Model X. This is like the new one too. Board. Man, this smell like bacon. It smell like breakfast. But like we said, we is getting picked up from our resort. They in the Tesla Model X. All right. And we getting ready to head to the lounge, y'all. And then after the lounge, we got to get on another plane and then a boat. So it takes a lot to get where we going. Man, the steering wheel is on the other side. Whoa. They brought us some 
She said this was some honey. I don't know. I, but I'm not honey gonna. Black pepper. I ain't gonna drink this. I ain't gonna do it. I need to see my resort. So we checking in for our seaplane. No, we checking in for our next plane. And then after that, I'm ready to ride out. Cause on these planes, we ain't seen nothing. We ain't seen no water. We ain't seen no land. We just in the middle of the plane in our business class seat. And what's so cool about business class too, they got the little sticker on your bag to say business. Hey, we standing on business. Big business. Oh, we got some milk. Well, they're taking yeah, care of They're taking care of it. seen anything so what's the word hospital the hospitality is so fire drinks oh close out thank you mm -hmm. I'm gonna put this on my face but I'm can go out oh outside thank you oh man what did this man just lock me out here thank you so have you been before to never? Hmm? This is the first time? Yes, first time. Thank you. Install your replay applications. You can see the all the applications or events in Tonewa Dani. Yeah. Thank you. Oh my goodness. That's water. Watermelon juice? Mm -hmm. I could smell. Law have mercy. Law have mercy. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna swallow it. So, have y'all took a guess on where we at by now? Some of y'all probably know, some of y'all probably don't know, but everything just been a 10 out of 10 so far with the airport pickup, the business class, the lounge, our seaplane over there, like. We got an hour flight to the resort off the plane, then we're gonna hop on the boat, and then y'all, once we get to the resort, Kenny, they gonna take our shoes. I know y'all probably like, why they gonna take our shoes, y'all? We literally pack no shoes. It is a, that's helpful too, because yeah. you'll be overweight on them slides, but it is an eco-friendly uh, resort. So over here's a little snack area. He said we can help ourselves. So I think I'm gonna start off with me an ice cream cone. They got cone, strawberry marshmallow. I've never seen the strawberry marshmallow. Um, ju jujubes. Ju I ain't never seen that. I don't know what that is. Chocolates and the whole ice cream bar. So I got mango sherbet, raspberry sherbet, passion, strawberry ice cream. It's too much. <laughs> Look at all of this. Y'all, the hotel that we was gonna stay at, they lounge is literally over there. But we picked this one. No, you picked this one, me or you? But we mm, both decided. I think I'm, I, I yeah, forced it. Yeah, that's the only one I want to go to. That's the only one I want to go to. That's the only one I want to go to. I said, okay, cool. What's over here? And some cheese. It's I'm going to make this ice cream. Okay, gonna, you make mine too. You make yours. So. On a waffle cone? Yes, you just. Yeah. You want a waffle cone? I do. No, it's strawberry. So it's, I guess that's the strawberry. Your boy know how to make my ice cream. You got it? Did I break this? I think you just let it, let it back. This man done took the whole dough off the ice cream machine. Jenny, you're supposed to let it up. Give me the cone. Give me the cone. One scoop of strawberry, please, Mr. Ice Cream Man. I ain't never rolled no uh, ice cream like this. Not too much, man. I'm gonna be sick. I ain't ate no breakfast. Raham, I tell them that I done tore the thing up. Can you tell them for me? It's my birthday. Can you just put the thing on me? Just tell them. Look, you just tell them it's my birthday. I'm about to go. You was over. Okay. Put it back on there. I gotta get me some.
Y'all, we just landed in the middle of the ocean. We landed in the middle of the ocean. Come on now. This is a fourth transportation vehicle. Mm -hmm. Really high because we took a Tesla. Lord Jesus. No news, no shoes. No news, no shoes. No news, no shoes. Okay. This one got your initials on it. Let's take out the shoes. I mean, I can do this back, so. And everybody has your initials. What about that? Oh, you want to keep that? I'm going to put my back. You keep it very simple. AL. I will leave it. I will keep this in your room. Don't worry, I'm just hiding them. No. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Right. And we are in Sinai, right? We do have an island town, which is one hour ahead of Malay town. So we are you the same time as Bangladesh, Dhaka town. Okay. So we are now 50 minutes. Okay. Yeah, one hour. Finally, share the timing on your phone so you will not miss any appointment here. Okay. Thank you. Hi, nice to meet you, Charles. Ken, nice to meet you. Hi. Hi, how are you? Hello. Hello. Welcome Thank to Sunny Journey. Thank welcome you. Welcome to Sunny Journey. Hi. Hello, welcome. Thank you. I know y'all probably anticipated and y'all way to see where we at. One, two, three, get it where we at. Right. We in the Maldives. Now, I don't want to show y'all too much because y'all know the wrong tour come right after this. And then after that, you know, it's your boy's birthday. And then after that, I don't know. I don't we got a photo shoot. <laughs> yeah, we got, we got. We got a lot. Y'all yeah. see this villa, right? This is all us. Look at this. I can run a map. I think we then started becoming travel influencers, villa influencers. I don't know what to call it. Villa we influ travel influencers We're at this travel point. Influencers. All the brands need to hit us up because y'all. How we, we go from Bora Bora to, to the Maldives, Maldives in a and matter of four weeks? Big villa? Come on now. Like Queen and Ken in the Maldives. Maldives. Hey. Queen and Ken in the Maldives. Hey, from the trenches to the Maldives. <laughs> Bruh, I'm from Birmingham, Alabama. I'm from Memphis, man. Come on now. Like, what? This vlog has already been long enough. We have literally used up this whole memory card, and this memory card is like a hundred and some gigs. We're, We're about, about to, to get, get ready. 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 We're finna get ready for our room tour because I know y'all highly anticipated to see this room. Like, look at this bit. Like, okay, so it's been. Hold up. We took a seaplane and landed on the water. On the water. Like, we in the middle of the ocean. We in the middle of the ocean. Take your phone out right now and go to the bottom of India and just zoom in on the middle of the ocean. We somewhere in that vicinity. Man, right, it's unbelievable, bruh. Like, what? Y'all see this place on Instagram so many times and I'm like, bruh, how we gonna go there? Because y'all, this place is expensive. This is one of the world's best freaking resorts, I'm telling y'all. And this is crazy. This a board board. This. Okay. I'm gonna book some extra days. No cap. The pool was so big. Like, I okay. didn't realize how big this was. And it's just. And we us. Gotta, okay, y'all gotta watch the room tour, okay? So, with that being said, we really hope y'all enjoyed this video. So, make sure y'all give this video a big thumbs up. Make sure y'all leave comments down below. Comment where y'all think we should go next already because baby, we got stuff lined up. Especially when we go home, we got something to we tell y'all. We got a surprise oh. for y'all. Yeah, I told y'all I had a surprise for this video, something that I got for my birthday, but I'm just gonna show it in the next vlog. Yeah. So, so we finna go ahead and get ready for the room tour. Y'all know how we do it. We keep everything the same. Get her room tour, boom. Then our um, butler, she finna come pick us up in a little bit and show around the whole resort. Y'all, this resort is huge, okay? This resort is Literally three like, miles long. Look, it's all the way over there too. It's so far, it turned, it's blurry. It's hazy. Y'all, I, I can't, can't believe we in the Maldives. They got bumblebees out here? This been one of our dream vacation destination and we here. Comment down below, Queen Ken. Oh, what the? What is that? What is that? Okay. 
bitch got a horn on his head. You right. need to hold. Let me hold the camera. I don't trust your hands. Okay, y'all coming down below, Queen Ken. We so proud of y'all. Like, come on, that black excellence, black luxury. We showed out for Black History Month. Now we showing out for the you know spring break month. You know this is how we do spring month. break. This is how we do spring break. You know what I'm saying? We gonna hold on, PDK. I don't know. I don't know what country. You know what I'm saying? The rules and regulations. Here. Also, I ain't gonna say. It. I'm gonna say it for the next video. So with that being said, y'all, we gonna see y'all in the next vlog. Peace.